He found a beautiful, quiet place near a river, chose a tree, and sat down under it to meditate. I shall not move from this spot until I have discovered the answer, he vowed, no matter how long it takes. No one knows just how long Siddhartha sat there in ever deeper meditation. But there came a time, just as the sun rose, when a great change came over him and he knew that he had achieved his goal. Through his own efforts, he had seen deeply into the nature of how things really are. That experience had changed him so utterly that he was no longer an ordinary human being. He was totally free. He was completely peaceful, happy and compassionate. He had become enlightened. He had become a Buddha. The word Buddha means one who is awake, awake to the truth. So what was the great truth that Siddhartha Gautama woke up to? What was it that he understood as he sat on the bank of a river meditating? Buddhists believe it is only by becoming enlightened ourselves that we can really understand what enlightenment is. Ideas and words can only point the way. They believe that in this newfound wisdom, the Buddha understood that everything is constantly changing, that nothing stays the same or lasts forever. He saw that all things are interdependent, ceasing to exist when conditions change. This is true both of ourselves and of other people, of our belongings and the world around us. It is even true of the stars. Nothing in the universe lasts forever. He understood that although this is the way the world really is, we don't want it to be like this. Instead, we live our lives expecting things to last. We want things to be permanent, and when they turn out to be impermanent, we suffer and are unhappy. 